So in the teaser and a sneak peek for the next episode, we get lots and lots of snow. Finally, we get that for The Walking Dead, and something everyone in the show has probably been dealing with, but it's the first time we've ever been shown it. And Michonne and the others have never dealt with such a big storm like the one we're going to be getting. And finally, the kingdom is officially done for. Everyone's leaving the kingdom, as it looks like it, it can no longer support itself. I don't think it's just because of the storm. After being forced to abandon the kingdom, they're heading into Whisperer territory, as a snowstorm has blocked all of the major routes. We even get a shot of the them going across the infamous border from the last episode that Alpha made. So that's definitely going to be a very dramatic scene. So I expect most of the next episode to be everyone from the kingdom moving away to a more hospitable home, most likely Hilltop, because Michonne was mentioning waypoints that they got set up. So clearly it's a route that they already know. Although it would be kind of cool to get new environments, let's say they were heading further out away from Alexandria and all the other three communities. But I just don't think we're going to be getting that. I think the kingdom, or formerly the kingdom, and Alexandria are all going to be heading to Hilltop top, and so everyone can ride out the storm together. Hilltop, of course, is now leaderless, although I'm sure they got a stand-in of some kind. Jesus actually would have been a good leader. It's a shame he was killed by the Whispers so early on. But it's very interesting that Alexandria was at the very least temporarily abandoned because we have Gabriel, RJ, and even Negan coming with them. Because Michonne isn't going to let Negan freeze to death, despite how much she would hate him. We actually have this image here of Negan being handcuffed to a bed inside some kind of cabin. The same cabin everyone else is staying at. Of course, Negan being Negan, he's smiling and talking to someone, acting like he's in total control of the situation. Since he's in the same cabin as everyone else, I would love to see Eugene and Negan finally have a conversation. After all, it's been many, many years since Eugene was nothing more than a bullet maker for Negan back in the war, and Eugene is basically the reason Negan lost his war against Alexandria, so that would make a very, very awkward conversation. Of course, we're also going to get some stuff with Carol and Lydia. Carol, understandably, is not accepting Lydia, as Lydia is basically the, the issue the reason Henry and everyone is dead. Lydia was, after all, the catalyst that began the many, many skirmishes leading up to Alpha marking her territory. In the teaser, not the sneak peek, uh, we see that Lydia also feels terrible, and no doubt feels responsible for what happened, and that it's looking like Carol is going to be forgiving her in this episode. Based on that short clip we got of Lydia holding that small metal barbed wire thing against her neck, basically offering Carol to get revenge on her, Carol seeing how bad Lydia clearly feels about the situation will probably allow her to accept Lydia as part of the group. And that's kind of where that situation is going to be wrapped in a nice bow tie. Of course, the next big thing is the zombie walkers that we're going to be getting. And it's going to be very cool to see in the next episode, and hopefully in a good portion of the next season, all of these frozen walkers. All the fun ways Greg Nicotero can design the unique zombie deaths and the basic walker design now that they're in the winter. It, it should be a very, very awesome addition to the show. And really, this snowstorm could weaken everyone to the point where you can rekindle that thing The Walking Dead's been missing, which is actually fear of the zombies, of the walkers, because everyone's so proficient at killing them now that it's they're kind of just there for the sake of being there, at least in a lot of situations. The snow could give walkers some unique scares and advantages in the blizzard, especially if they can't see anything. Like I imagine we're gonna get lots of scenes of walkers being frozen to each other or being stuck to things in general, like stuck to the road, stuck to piping or buildings, just frozen solid in general. So really I'm happy we're getting the snow and the walkers, how Negan will interact with everyone, and hopefully you as well, and if we'll get any hint of what's to come for Negan, of course, no spoilers uh, for future seasons, but it's going to be very exciting. And Angela King has promised some kind of twist in the next episode. Now, no one's going to be dying, I can imagine, since we had so many deaths in the last episode, so it's going to be a twist story wise. Whatever it is, though, I'm sure it'll be great enough to hype us up for the next season because we do need some kind of cliffhanger after all, and that's obviously what Angela King was talking about. But, anyways, uh, make sure to like and subscribe, and thanks for watching.